Hey everybody, it's Crystal. Oh, wow. Giving you some Jacqueline Smith realness. Hi guys, it's Crystal. Um, I wanted to just uh, make this really very quickly to let you know that on May 26th, 2017, I am giving a really rad and really awesome class called Many Mansions, Navigating the Interdimensional Worlds. We're talking about dimensionality in this class. We're talking about octaves, which are levels within dimensions. We're talking about universal architecture. We're talking about interdimensional beings. We're going to learn about who those are because in fact, the angels are interdimensional beings and the fairy are, and the guides are, and so are the ETs or the star born civilization. So we're going to go over the different kinds of energies and patterns of energies and indeed beings that we can encounter interdimensionally. And here's the thing. And this is part of 3D reality. We often buy into this illusion that we're separate and not connected to these other realities. When in reality, we as human beings here alive on the planet right now are multi-dimensional beings. In fact, we spend 50-50, so half and half time, one step in 4D, so four dimensional reality and one step in 3D, because when we go to bed, we're 4D. When we are here in the wakeful consciousness, we are 3D. So we're already multi-dimensionally, just conventionally speaking. But we also have access to all other dimensions in our particular universe, also called a house. And there are many dimensions. And that's what we're going to be talking about because within these separate dimensions exist a certain quality of energy that gives life to certain truth and knowledge and in specific certain beings and these beings, the high vibrational beings, they want to help us to shift. They want to help us to ascend and go higher than just 3d or 4d, go up into five, six and seven D and higher. That's where they are. And that's where this information and energy is coming from. I'm going to dedicate an entire module to starborn beings. Those beings we might call ETs or ultra terrestrials, whatever. <laughs> I used to not believe actually in aliens for most, most of my life. I did not believe it. I thought it was hokey and kind of ridiculous until of course I had my own encounter with interdimensionals. And now I know what the truth and the reality is of that situation. So I want to talk about the different interdimensionals that are presently interacting with people on the planet now, because if you're a spiritual seeker, if you are a light worker, it is likely that they have already attempted to make contact with you. I'm not talking about abduction or UFOs. I'm talking about just interdimensional contact with you to give you information and to work with you. But again, because we're locked into the 3d reality, we don't realize that they're communicating with us or giving us downloads. And so what does that feel like? What are they trying to tell us? We're going to talk about all of these beings and really cool. I'm going to talk to you about some of you because some of you have very definite affiliations with star civilizations or star beings. Some of us respond more, for example, to Andromedans or Arcturians or Pleiadians, right? There's a reason for that. And we can kind of tell whether we have these affiliations. I'm going to lead you through an exercise where you'll figure it out for yourself. Now, the last module in this really awesome class is going to be all about communication and interdimensional communication is different being to being angels are going to feel different than an ET or an ultra terrestrial. Fairies are going to feel different than our deceased grandmother. All of these beings are existing in different dimensional spaces, but they feel different to us. So we'll talk about why that is, how they present, and also how we can initiate contact with interdimensionals. I'm going to stop right here. There's a lot of information. We're going to be teaching on all sorts of really, really fascinating subjects and topics. And so if this interests you even a little, please go to this URL right here and check it out. There's a video. Um, there's kind of a overview of what we're going to be teaching module to module. And if it does interest you and it resonates, then I encourage you to sign up ASAP because this is going to be a live class. Although the content is going to be distributed online, and you can move through it at your leisure, there is going to be a study group and that group will be live. 
will be assembled in a private group and I'm going to be there every single day, all day, every day, talking to each student. Now I love this because I really have an opportunity to get to know these students and learn more about them and answer additional questions that might come up. And these additional questions often help me with the content um, for later students. But because it's just me and my group of students, I can only take so many. So if you're interested at all, I encourage you, again, check it out and register, sign up, get your space. As an incentive, I'm offering a discount for the next, I know I don't have a watch on, I wanna say two weeks, I think that's what we did. Uh, two weeks, we've got a discount so that it's a little bit easier for, for people, um, but it's only going to be up, discount and all, until the spaces are filled, and I don't think that it will even be up through those two weeks. As soon as I get the last person, I'm shutting it down. So act now, join us. It's gonna be really fantastic. And cherry on top, check it out. Cherry on top is, we are gonna have an attunement service. What's an attunement service? Well, I do something called attunements. Attunements are energetic adjustments. They're actually like gifts that come from spirit, are channeled through me, and then routed into you. And these are gonna be interdimensional in nature. They're gonna be very specific to your ability to up level to such a degree that you can make this interdimensional contact. So we're adjusting around that. We're gonna have healings, we're gonna have openings and activations. All of this happens in an attunement service. And I don't give these often, and all of my students are gonna be invited to one of these ser services. And I'm also gonna take requests. So if you have like a question or like, hey, can you help me with my crown chakra open it? Or I, I need to see, I, I, my clairvoyance is on and off. Well, what we can do is get that attunement and shift it for you so that the clairvoyance opens. That is the cherry on top and I'm excited about all of it. So that's what I got going on. I hope that you sign up and I can't wait to see you in class. Bye guys.